My name's Jacob Butler and today I'm heading back to my hometown of Mount Gambier in South Australia to do some workshops for the local high school and some local press in promotion of my new single Come My Way. I've just picked up my good friend and cameraman Andre from the airport and we have a five hour drive ahead of us and we've got some rockin' tunes to keep us entertained. later it's uh, midnight and here we are in the beautiful Mount Gambia. Um, we're gonna get some kip now and I guess we're gonna see you in the morning. Peace. Yeah music's always been a part of my life growing up with my dad you know he played in bands and my grandfather he plays the uh, button accordion and the sax. I always enjoyed it but I didn't really sort of start taking a big interest till I saw uh, Nirvana Unplugged in New York when I was like 12. It just blew me away and I basically started playing the guitar and that's when, uh, you know, What's the Story, Morning Glory came out by Oasis a bit later that year and it was just like, wow. And, um, you know, it's been non-stop ever since. This is my Nana. Hello, Joe. This is my Papa. Hello, how you going? And this is my other Nan. Oh, all right then. Hello, Jake. I'm Nanny Pat. I'm Jake's Nanny Pat. <laughs> That's all, take it off now. <laughs> so here we are at uh, ABC in Mount Gambia. It's uh, morning and we're about to go and chat with Stan Thompson. 20 past nine, Jack, I've been looking forward to this ever since I knew he was around the place. Jacob Butler, hello, welcome to you. What have you been up to? Um, well, I finished recording an album last year um, that I spent a lot of time on and I'm very happy with it. And the first single's heading out to radio now. So I think um, I think my sound, it's evolved a little bit and it's, I've always been a very big fan of English guitar music, you know sort of from the Beatles to the Who through to more modern bands. And, um, you know, it's sort of where I'm at and it just, it's a good fit. Yeah, we're backstage here at MGHS. Kids are just rolling in now. In a few minutes, I'm going to head out there and, and say hello. And I just want the kids to really enjoy themselves. And, and you know, they're all music students, so I just want to kind of show them that you know, if they work hard, not that I'm you know a multi-millionaire, but not not even a one millionaire, but uh, you know, that they can pursue what they want to do and, and, and make a living out of it. You know. Local musical talent Jacob Butler was back in the southeast today. The former Mount Gambier High student lending his talents in a performance and workshop. So there's a story that uh, you ran into one of your idols not long ago. Yeah, I, um, I ran into Noel Gallagher uh, from Oasis um, in traffic in Melbourne um, a few weeks ago, and I was just like, oh wow, he's in a van next to me, and I'm like, really? So I um, gave him a wave and, and I had a copy of my album on the passenger side so I just grabbed it and went, here's my record man and he was sort of a bit plex looking and um, he took it off me and you know he said thanks and that was it. This is Mount Gambia's famous blue lake and here's the lemonade that comes straight from it. Mmm, delicious. I had a great time in Mount Gambia and I think the workshops went really well. I didn't sugarcoat things for the kids I really appreciated the fact that they were into that, you know. I told them that it was really important to hone their craft and it's a marathon, not a sprint, especially in the arts. 
It takes a lot of courage and a lot of patience and a little bit of madness, but if you love it, then you just have to do it.